Hey guys, Johnny here back with a brand new COD Mobile video. Today I unlocked my first diamond gun. Not my first diamond camo though, but my first gun. And I want to share with you guys my method, how I do that. Uh, it's going to be the AK-47 and my first diamond camos were the launchers. I did the FHJ-18 on the first day of the reset. The day after I did the SMRS, all you need to do for the launchers is 100 UAVs destroyed. And counter UAVs don't work. Then after that, I equipped the axe on all my loadouts and uh, I did unlock the axe. 500 kills you need, not too hard, but I didn't do just the axe. Uh, and you will see what I do today. Now I'm working on the knife and uh, after the knife, I'll do my pistols. But what I do is I equip the melee on all my loadouts. And when I get my 10 kills with the AK-47, instead of killing myself and switching loadouts, I just switch to the knife and get a few kills before I die. So I get a few knife kills every game, every time I change loadouts. And then when I die, I change to the QQ9. I'm halfway there, 60 of 120. And then again, when I get 10 kills, I switch with DRH. And if I see the game is not going to be long enough for me to go for the fourth weapon, then I finish the game with the knife. And that's how I unlock my axe. So you can do four or five weapons if you want. Now, what I did is I did three or four weapons instead of four or five, but I did my secondaries at the same time. So let's jump into a game, guys. And that's going to be my last one, guys. I'm at 149 here out of 150 on the AK-47. So I'm going to show you how I do it. And uh, you let me know also in the comments, what is your first diamond gun? Or your first diamond camo if it wasn't a gun. Now, of course, I like to do hardpoint shipment. I know some of you guys do other maps or other game modes. Let me know in the comments, what's your favorite mode for uh, farming diamond camos? But all you need uh, is 10 kills every game. I know some guys like to quit and then uh, start another game and quit at 10 kills. Some guys in the comments say it doesn't work. It does work. I just did it a couple of times just before recording this video just to test again this guy so that's two kills i hear m16 bro that's pretty bad dude i keep getting stuck man said bro i'm stuck all right so as you can see i got more than 10 kills now i got 11 kills so i could switch to the knife and then Whenever I'm gonna die, then I'm gonna switch loadouts. Who's using M16? Like, you gotta have more than 10 kills by now, right? Oh, my capture card crashed. But at least my game didn't freeze, so... Who's using M16, dude? Oh, crap. I mean, that dude's been using uh, M16... Since the start of the game. Usually people switch guns after 10 kills, right? Oh crap. Hey, that's gotta be more than 10, right? I switch to the knife now. I mean, I think so. And then when I die, I'll go DRH. Oh, come on. I was turning the corner. So that method, though, you might be losing track. So every time I, I switch, you can check your count. I'm at 23, so I need to go to 33 with the DRH. Crap. What was that? There's a guy there. Imagine using that. Uh, I use it only when people use the riot shield. Because riot shield is so annoying. Is it even the name? Riot Shield? Anyways, you know what I'm talking about, right? That shield. Come on, dude. I didn't click. For some reason. You gonna drop shot? No. Oops. Lol. No scope. Hard scope. Gotta be more than 10, right? So see here, the score is 113, 130. So I could switch to a fifth gun. 
Maybe I would have time, maybe I wouldn't. Like, it really depends on the lobbies. But that's what I do now. Since I'm working on the knife, I'll just finish the game with the knife. Um, it's just tough. Like, it's easier versus butts, of course. Like, if you get a butt lobby... Because real players... They won't let you get in their face too much. Like, I got lucky here. Quick double kill, but... Like, usually, you're gonna get killed. So you try to find these butts in the lobby if you can. Oh crap. I'm go around this guy. There was a guy there. Okay, okay, okay. Good run. Oh crap. Oh boy. How am I still alive? You're reloading or something? Bro, I should be dead right now. Okay, let's go. Oh crap. No! So I was able to do four guns plus, I don't know, 10 plus knife kills at the same time. Defeated. Don't let this happen again. And here we go. That's the beautiful diamond camo unlocked. So here's the look at the uh, AK-47 diamond. And you can click on default look. That's new this season uh, from the last update. So you see the wooden parts, uh, they're all golden. It looks pretty good for real. And um, yeah, if you change the barrel in front, it could be all diamond if you don't uh, click the default. And also there are some black parts here, the attachments. Some people have been asking on Reddit, um, the attachments, like if you put a scope or a red dot, I can show you uh, with a red dot, it would be black, see? So it would be cool if the attachments would be gold on the diamonds and the gold guns. I don't know what you guys like, but uh, it would look probably a little better. So, but anyways, that's the look of the AK-47 diamond. Now my progression on the other stuff, like I said, the knife, uh, I just started yesterday, I think. I did a little bit. So I'm at 159 kills right now out of 500. So. If you do a little bit like that every game, it's actually pretty fast to finish your melee weapons. And I wish the baseball bat was available soon because uh, it's been in the game for a while now. We cannot unlock the camos yet on the baseball bat. So maybe next season would be nice. So yeah, like I said, I'll finish the knife. Then I'll keep the same method, but then when I die, I can switch to the pistol and try to get 10 kills. Because the pistol, you need 10 kills every game. So yeah, that's it for now, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know how you're doing on the diamond grind. I read all the comments. So let me know what was your first one. What are you working on? My next one will be the QQ9. I'm like 60, 61 games out of 120. I'm also working on the DRH and the Locust at the same time. So yeah, my method, uh, like you don't get a gun every day, but once you start rolling, you unlock a bunch of gun at the same time. So it's going to be pretty cool. All right, that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Smash like if you enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.